everybody. Travis Chandler, Chandler Gaming, back here with the next episode of the Soldier Series of Mass Effect 3. Before we get the video, be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and turn on those notifications. You'll be notified of all my videos. We're just going to get down to it here. Um, nothing really went on last week. Um, you know, just uh, um, heat wave and all, but I mean, nothing really went on much, so... No, I take that back. There was one thing that happened. Um, went last Wednesday, I went to Dollar General. I'd get some things, and it was busy as hell there. And um, Shepard, I heard about Thessia. We were so close, Anderson. So damn close to ending this war. You didn't think it'd be that easy, did you? I knew going in there wouldn't be a minute of this war that was easy. But watching Thessia fall, and knowing it was my responsibility. Shepard, you know how many times I got my ass handed to me over the years? Surviving the first contact war back in the day was a goddamn miracle. They said I was a hero. I just felt lucky to get out alive. So maybe Kai Lang did beat you. What of it? It could cost us the war. These guys in the Resistance, they know it's a losing proposition. They know the chances of seeing tomorrow are slim to none. But we all signed up anyway. Hell, I'm sitting in London right now staring at rubble. I was born here. And it's looking like I might die here too. So I say point us at the Reapers and we'll take our chances. You'll make it, Anderson. And when this is all over, you can show me London. <laughs> it might need a new coat of paint first. This will be over soon. It better. Shake this off, Shepard. I will. And as an out. All right, but um, like I said, I was going to um, I went to Dollar General. It was busy as hell, and there was this lady checking out. She had a bunch of stuff in her cart, but she, she kept typing in the wrong pin for her debit card. And we've all done that. We've forgotten our pins and all that. Well, she had tried it so many times that it locked her out. Well. She just stood there and kept talking and talking and talking. And it's like, dude, come on. All you're doing is holding up the line and all this shit, you know? Commander, Cerberus has attacked a comm facility on Onteron. I've updated the galaxy map. This lady kept holding up the line. There was like five or six people ahead of me. And it's like, come on, lady. You need to quit holding up the line. You need to get out of the way. You know? Shepard, this wasn't your fault. It's not about fault. I was supposed to stop them. You will. I don't know if I can do this, Tally. Earth, Palavin, Thessia. I'm risking everything to build the Crucible, and I'm not even sure what it does. Who am I to make that call? You're the one who was right all along. You fought when no one else would, when nobody else believed you. You can do this. I know you can. I'm sorry, Shepard. You all right? I'm fine. Liara? I don't know. Okay. I'll talk to her. Thanks. This isn't something she should deal with by herself. Same goes for you. Sure.
Okay, so they're down a level. That's where they are. Okay. Hmm, we're getting some lag. There we go. That's not true. We earned our place in the galaxy. Stop denying reality, Asari. Your people took the knowledge of my people from the beacon. I have a name. It's Liara Tassoni, and I'd have... Hey, settle down. My home was just destroyed, and all he can do is gloat. Given what's happened today, I think you owe Liara an apology, Javik. Apologize for the truth? For not doing more. You're a Prothean. You were supposed to have all the answers. How could you not stop this from happening? We believed you would. Long ago, we saw the potential in your people. Even then, it was obvious. The wisdom, the patience. You were the best hope for this cycle. So you were guided when necessary. Well, it didn't work. You're still alive, aren't you? Your world may have fallen, but as long as even one Asari is left standing, the fight isn't over. I guess that goes for Protheans, too. Despair is the enemy's greatest weapon. Do not let them wield it. Liara Tassoni. That was unexpected. Thank you. We still need her talents. If grief overcomes her, she will be lost to us. So did you actually mean what you said? Does it matter? Liara's been a good friend to me. It matters. Then I will tell you what you want to hear. I meant what I said. Carry on. Okay. More than likely, Diana's got something to say, too. folding chair or something. I talked with Williams. Between the 212, Horizon, and the Council's other guards, it's like death just follows her around. Uh, yeah, it's true. Alright, we're ready to... We're gonna do the Cerberus mission, and then, um... We'll go to the apartment and do the fun stuff. We'll check around Athena though to see if there's anything. I found something. Reapers eluded. Sorry, engineers. We'll take those. Faster than light jump successful. Evasion successful. There it is. All right. Reapers eluded. Out of there we go. We'll go to the next one. Signal confirmed. Ooh, we found the wreckage. There we 
we go. Nice. We'll take the research ships. Faster than light jump successful. Okay, what do we get here? Out of there we go. Nice. What are we going to find here? something okay that's it all right cool We'll do the communication hub first. And then we'll go to the apartment and have fun. I didn't think there's anything. Okay. Radius. You. You. There we go. Down there. 
I'm staying hidden, but I'm the only one left. They're trying to hack into our systems to access Alliance operations protocols. I'm tracking their activity, but they're bound to find me sooner or later. Hang in there. We'll be there soon. Yes. Yes, Commander. It's not ideal, but she's the only one with any traction on this. The information stored in that network is critical, Commander. If it gets into enemy hands, we'll lose a lot of good people. I'll take care of it, Admiral. See that you do. Hack it out. I love this gun, I really do. It's way OP, man. Commander Shepard, Cerberus shuttles are scouring the area. I think they're looking for me. They're using comms to pinpoint Sato's location. Oh no, how do we... Nothing's changed. Just upload the next set of coordinates. I... Yes, Commander. Updating your nav point. Probably put the head trauma. Misato, come in. Misato, are you there? The human is too scared to answer. We need the final coordinates. Grace, listen to me. Can't talk. They're right outside. I know you're scared. This is more than you signed up for, but I won't let you down. I promise. Okay, Commander. Updating your nav point with the last location now. But if you get to me in time. Just hurry, please. Commander, I think I can make a run and get her. Do it. I think I got one. 
in there. I don't think I got that nemesis, but I think I got like a centurion or something. Good job, Lieutenant. Our communication station is secure. Operations in this theater are safe again. No small task to keep it that way. How is Misato doing? She has to be transferred to a nearby Alliance station. She wants to help however she can. Good. We need all the help we can get. Hack it out. All right. So we'll go back to the apartment now and have some fun. Welcome aboard, Shepard. So where are we going? Activating external cameras. I didn't know this shuttle had virtual windows. Bet there's more you don't know about this bird. What's that supposed to mean? Before Mass Effect fields, there was no such thing as inertial dampeners. Yeah? Here, feel this. Whoa! That, my friend, is unadulterated momentum. Want to really feel it? Show me. <laughs> you see? It doesn't take much to pull a few G's. Back in the day, pilots would wear G-suits. It squeezes your body so that the blood stays in your head in tight maneuvers. I'd wear a G-suit when flying my trident. In a fighter, it's common to transfer power from the inertial dampeners to other systems. You miss flying fighters? Can't imagine you're too thrilled to be flying a shuttle. Hell no. I'm not just any shuttle pilot. I'm your shuttle pilot. Wouldn't have it any other way. When you're on the ground, weapon in hand, you're invincible. But when we're approaching an LZ, you're just another soldier. Vulnerable. Nothing you can do if we're shot down. Getting you to the ground alive is a responsibility I wouldn't trust to anyone else. I'm fortunate to have you, Steve. Anytime, Shepard. Okay. Jacob's at six. Shepard over here. Thanks for coming by. Good to see you. What's up? Out for a little R&R. &R. You? Exactly. Same thing. 
Hey, Jacob, I'm out of credits. Who are they? Their parents are MIA, volunteered to take them on for the weekend, get their minds off things. What about us, Shepard? There's got to be a game of skill in there with our names on it. Let's do it. Great. I'm not good at this game. This is your game of skill. Now, Shepard, I'll try not to embarrass you. Really? Trash talk? That shattered Ezo? Hell yeah, my pride is on the line. Also, these kids look up to me, so I have to take you down. You're gonna take me down? I don't think so. Well, step up, Shepard. Although it might be tough not having your squad to carry you. Oh, shit. No pressure, Shepard. These people already idolize you. So when you choke, it won't matter. You're crowding me. Am I? My bad. Stand back, everyone. Shepard needs extra room to make the magic happen. Ready? Let's do this. Glad none of your friends are here to see your humiliation. That all you got? Check it out, Shepard. Feel that? That's the feeling of doom. Never mind. Hey, guys. You crying yet, Jacob? Boom! Killed it! Yeah, see, I'm not... I'm not good at that game. Not my day. Congrats, Jacob. Ah, you probably let me win. Come on, Shepard. Just grab some food. I'm buying. I'm sure if I practice that game, I get better at it, but... Ah, fuck it, you know? Welcome to Castle Arcade. Stay out of trouble. Alright, so back to the... Apartment here. Got a couple we need to do there. See, I changed all this, but for some reason it doesn't stay, and I, I don't understand that. I mean, look at that. None of it changed. Well, this did, but... Ah, well. Oh, yeah, that's right. Coliat. I forgot Coliat, too.
We're doing a tribute to Thane. We are gathered here to honor the life of Thane Krios. Thane touched each of our lives in different ways. The counselor knew him as a hero. The Normandy's crew knew him as a brother in arms, and others as a father devoted to his son. Though his life took him to very dark places, Thane cared for the better angels of our nature. Even when he was terminally ill, he ran through war-torn streets to reach me because he knew I needed help. You all know the results of that day. An assassin, a professional criminal, gave his life for his galaxy. And now he can rest. Would anyone else like to speak? What I remember about Thane was his confidence. He told me once about how he remembered everything, even every mistake he made. If I did that, I'd be a nervous wreck. Thane kept it under control. It's strange, but the last word I label Thane with is assassin. And we covered each other in firefights. That makes him a partner. Thane's last stand was important, but let us also remember why Thane left the Normandy. To keep his son away from a life of crime. Deeds such as these do not go unnoticed by the universe. They echo in all who hear them. That is why I am here. Thane took himself seriously, a trait with which I did not always agree. I tried to make him laugh on several occasions, but what I interpreted as a lack of humor was masking a great effort. Thane was turning his life around in a way few organics do. The day Thane came onto the Normandy, all Kelly and I knew about him was that he could probably kill us all with a ballpoint pen. But after you got to know him, there wasn't any reason to be afraid. He let you know where you stood. Colyat, do you, uh... said men must be loyal to their friends and dangerous to their enemies. But when he prevented me from, from hurting someone, he had changed. He said enemies and ego are not as important as loved ones. I didn't want to hear it. I was lost. I called him a hypocrite in a thousand different ways. He said that he was going soft. Now, I think maybe he did have it all figured out. That's all I can say. If anyone would like to continue, we'll be here. Looks like people are starting to clear out. Commander, thank you for holding this event. In time, it will be a good memory. I don't know if I'll be as philosophical about it. It's still kind of raw. I understand. If you will excuse me, I should take this opportunity to speak with the counselor. But what? He is feeling grateful, and I want to point out there are some Solarian biologists who need funding. If anyone would be able to create a breakthrough in the treatment of Keppel's syndrome, it would be them. If you need someone to hold the counselor's feet to a fire, I'm there. I appreciate the offer, but Counselor Valorn has recently orated about funding science during wartime. My odds are good. Oh, before I go, I was organizing my father's possessions, and I came upon copies of video messages he tried to send you. I sent them to your extranet address. I hope they help. More than they hurt. Until we meet again, Commander. Upstairs. 
upstairs? Yeah, it's upstairs. Shepard, I suppose I should thank you for my freedom. Leaving the Normandy was the right decision. It was saddening to see our crew go their separate ways. But it is better than answering questions in an Alliance interrogation room. I hope this message finds you well. As for me, I have moved into an apartment on the Citadel not far from Kolyat. I think the first attack I had frightened him. I will spare you the details. It seemed very dramatic at the time. But in comparison to the Omega Relay, it was a child's game. In any case, good luck getting the Alliance to listen to you. Let's keep in touch. Shepard, if you sent a message back, I didn't get it. I suppose communications from someone of my reputation would be restricted. The irony is, I am a danger to no one these days. I am even paying taxes on my investments. I can't expect Kolyat to do so if I don't. He is doing better. He has no significant other, and he is temperamental. But he is employed and staying out of crime. I can tell he is serious about changing. It has cost him more than a few friends. Send something back if you can, Shepard. I can only learn so much from news reports about you. I have tried a false identity to try to get this message through to you. We'll see if it works. I have good news and bad. The good news is that Kolyat and I took a few days to visit Earth. Light the shade of her eyes. Trill sound of chirping stops. I scan the ground. See two tiny bodies locked by claws. Excuse me. As I was saying, we saw a beautiful sunset in New Mexico and a scorpion eating a cricket. I wish you could have joined us. The bad news is, I had... I fainted and struck my head. Kolyat has convinced me to stay at Huerta Memorial on the Citadel. I will be there from now on. I still don't want to die in a hospital. But it's where the doctors are. And Kolyat. I love him. That means I must trust him. Goodbye, Shepard. Let me say that now, in case I cannot later. Poor Kolyat. Alright, I'm gonna fix this gun while I'm at it. I think I need the head trauma. Oh, I already have it on. Okay. Never mind. What's Liara want? She just wants bang 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 maybe? I don't know. This is the only song I know. Why is that? There was always something more important to do. A ruin to uncover, intel to gather, a commander to save. <laughs> you couldn't sit still long enough. <laughs> Could you? It's a good song. Thank you, Shepard. The person who taught me that song was a friend. I spend so much time chasing down knowledge. Sometimes I forget that there are things you learn by doing nothing. 
by just spending time with the people you care about. What have you learned from me? I suppose, how to get myself into life-threatening situations on a daily basis? I am a good teacher. <laughs> the best. Well, I should probably go. I have reports to look over. Right. But first, why don't you teach me that song? This place is nice. Shall I transfer over your reports so that you might work here? Yes, thank you, Glyph. The theme to Mass Effect. <laughs> That's all the R knows. Then Tally, she wants to hang out. Let's see what she wants to do. Hey, got any plans for the evening? No. I'm as free as the dust in the solar wind. You remember that line from Fleet and Flotilla? Shalai and Bellicus on the balcony. I don't think I've ever seen that. Did. What? You've never? How could you not have? Well, I know what we're doing tonight. Watched this a lot, huh? Every time my friends and I had a sleepover. Kila. So many feelings. Yeah, it's, uh. Yeah. Definitely. When this is done, I'll send you links to extranet sites with some captioned animations. I want you to see behind this mask. I want you to see who I truly am. I already have. She had an infection for three weeks after filming this scene. Totally worth it. All right. So that's it. Here on Silver Sun. So now we'll go to Sanctuary. Okay, back to Horizon. We went there in Mass Effect 2 through the colony. We're gonna bring Ashley. So really, um, we'll bring Javik. Okay. What do we know? Edie? The sanctuary facility was devoted to aiding refugees from Reaper-controlled systems. 
The facility went offline recently, and no communications have come or gone since. It is unclear why Kai Lang or Cerberus would be interested in Sanctuary. If there's a clue to Cerberus here, we find it. Sir, I'm picking up a signal from the facility. It's weak. I I'll try to boost it. This is Oriana Lawson. Stay away from Sanctuary. It's not what it seems. Please, you must listen to me. They're using... Oriana? That's Miranda's sister. If she's here, Miranda can't be far away. That's our link to Cerberus. Approaching the LZ. Seeing some damage, Commander, but no activity. Cerberus does not get the jump on us this time. Stay sharp, people. Why he defaults to his... Yeah. Um... Oh, you don't have any, and neither do you, I don't think. No, nope, you don't. But who was fighting? Everyone hear that? Yes, radio's offline. Something's jamming our signals. Explains no comms leaving the facility. were hunting them down. About time they started killing each other. Welcome to Sanctuary. For your safety, communication Now this is what I can't stand. They make you go around looking. I don't know. Come on. Cerberus shot came from that tower. Then that's where we're headed. They make you look around for how to unlock the door, and I, I just can't fucking stand it. All arrivals are asked to submit their possessions to our sorting staff for inspection. They will be returned inside the compound. Footage from security cameras. A place to organize the new arrivals. Come on, let's keep looking. This is what I can't stand, the sanctuary. Casualties, both sides. Ah, here we go. Cerberus. Cool. 
An observation deck. Looks like a dead end. We need an exit. Keep looking. Nice, we upgrade the pistol scope. being turned into husks. as well. She won't know that Kailang is here. Miranda Lawson has arrived sooner than expected. Do you want me to deal with her? 
Only if she gets in your way. Stay focused on the research data. Find it and get out. Yes, sir. Damn it. Let's move! to do it no scope but oh well gotta be more where they came from yeah you think I spent the last week making small adjustments to increase process efficiency there is no shortage of subjects Indeed, I'm told there's a long line outside the main gate the deception is an unfortunate necessity time is very short
guy. The elusive man. Heavy resistance outside the tower. If you're receiving this, I've got evidence you cannot ignore. Confirmation that my father is working for the elusive man. Connection established. I have your report on the process, Mr. Lawson. Cut to the chase. Can you do it? Theoretically, control is possible, yes. The Reaper subjects we converted are responding, but it's difficult to maintain. I thought that might be the case. Not to worry, Henry. With Sanctuary's help, we'll get it sorted. If he can control Reaper minions, we have a potent weapon. I'll play the rest of it. We've done it. We've found a way to co-opt their control signal. As long as the Reaper troops remain in close proximity to our signal, we can maintain control indefinitely. Excellent news. And how could we extrapolate this technique to apply to the Reapers themselves? That's a much bigger challenge. Now we know why the Reapers attacked Sanctuary. They ascertained what the Cerberus plan was. Unfortunate news for the elusive man. But it's good news for us. We finally have our link to Cerberus. Lowering the access ladder. Come on, let's move. One moment, Commander. It isn't finished. Damn it. I hope she's ready for him. How do you take care of a banshee? An exit up ahead. Yeah, I know. 
Oh, they're not gonna let me jump over? That's bullshit. Tower access granted. Get ready. Shepard. A commander. No! Excellent timing. Put the gun down. No. Ariana tried to shoot me. Miranda's poisonous influence, no doubt. I'm sorry she missed. Where's Kai Lang? I don't know. Gone. He took my research and left us here to die. Miranda, can you hear me? That's close enough. Both of you. Kai Lang didn't finish the job, but I will. This ends here. On the contrary. Now that the Reapers are taken care of, we have a way out. Let her go. Shepard, don't let him take her. Shepard, please. I have no problem with you. I just want Oriana and the research data. You want a lot. You get your life in return. How much is that worth? All right, take her. <clears throat> but I want out alive. Deal. No deal. Did he hurt you? Are you all right? It's okay, Ori. You're safe now. I'm fine. I just... I want to get out of here. We will. Give me a minute, okay? Commander Shepard. Fancy meeting you here. We caught a break. Are you all right? I'll be fine. Really. I don't know how you managed it, but I'm grateful you're here. Miranda, this whole thing was a huge risk. You should have told me. You have a war to win, Shepard. This was my fight. It's been a long time coming. You did it. It's over. Yes. I just wish my sister didn't have to see all this. About your father. I'm glad he's gone, Shepard. I'm sorry if that sounds cold. No. I understand. It's finally over. For both of us. We can stop running. Yes. You can. What's our status? Any intel we can use from this place? Research data is gone. But some basic facility information is still intact. Shuttle arrivals and departures, Cerberus included. No direct links, but it's a start. Grab anything you can off the computer. We'll take it back to be analyzed. I can do better than that. What? Before Kai Leng took off, I planted a tracer on him. If you act fast, you'll track him right to the elusive man. A tracer? Sounds like you thought of everything. <sighs> Not quite, but... Nobody's perfect. Thanks, Miranda. This is... exactly what we need. Thought you might need some good news. Damn right. What's next for you two? Get her someplace safe. Get the scratch cleaned up. Okay. I've got to follow all this up. I'll be in touch, Shepard. Soon. I hope so. Come on, Ari. We've had enough of Father's hospitality. Let's make sure everyone knows about this place. Communication scrambler disabled. Listen to me. This is not a refugee camp. This is a Cerberus facility run Cortex. by my father. Cortex, we need Henry to pick Olsen. up at the tower. Roger that. I've had enough of this place. I wasn't in favor of your diversion to Sanctuary, Commander. Too many unknowns. But I was wrong. The Cerberus lab you raided hinted at something big. But we never expected this. All those refugees, all that slaughter. Just to study indoctrination. Sanctuary did need to be shut down, sir. What they learned about the Reapers wasn't worth all those lives. It's useful intel, Commander, but you're right. The cost was too high. Do we have a location on the Elusive Man? Yes. 
We had a tracer on Kai Lang when he reported back. Good. That gives us a fighting chance to take Cerberus out of this war. Agreed. We need to end Cerberus and focus on the Reapers. My thoughts exactly. Hack it out. Okay. Well, I'm going to call it for this video. So, hope you all had fun this episode. I did. And I'll see you all next episode.